Happy Hanukkah, everybody. It's the fourth night of Hanukkah. And every day of Hanukkah, a few times, we say it together. Every time that we bench and every time that we say Shemona Esrei, we say al thanking Hashem for the special miracles of the Hanukkah story. But you know what's a little bit strange about al Is that the words are al for the miracles, Viala Purkan, and for saving us, Viala Gvuros, and for Hashem's strength, Viala Chuos, and for Hashem redeeming us. What's next? Vial Hamil Chamos, and for the wars. I understand why we're thanking Hashem for the miracles, and we're thanking Hashem for saving us, and we're thanking Hashem for His strength. Why would we thank Hashem for a war? Wouldn't we prefer not to have any wars? Don't we always prefer peace than battles? Why would we say to Hashem, thank you for Vial Hamil Chamos? Thank you for the wars. I'll tell you why I think we thank Hashem for the wars. Because there have always been people in this world who don't like us so much. And who wanted to fight against us, either physically in an actual war with an army, or spiritually, like in the Hanukkah story, where they didn't want to let us keep mitzvos. And guess what? A regular person, or a regular nation, or a regular group of people, the amount of times the Jews have had people who didn't like them would have just said, eh, forget it. It's not worth it. We give up. Let's just do whatever they tell us to do. One of the miracles of the Hanukkah story is that even when the Jewish people were very small people, and even when their army was not very strong, and even when their weapons were not very good, and even when they were facing the mightiest empire of their day, whether it was Paro and the Mitzrim, or Haman and Ahasuerus and the Persians, or the Hanukkah story of Antiochus and the Greeks, the miracle is we always stood up for what was right, and we always fought back. Now, of course, a large part of the miracle is that Hashem helped us win. That's an amazing part of the miracle. But an equally impressive part of the miracle is that we never gave up. So yes, of course, we'd rather peace and no fighting and no battles. And we daven for the time when Mashiach will come and there will be no more milchamos. But in the world that we live in even today, there are some people who just aren't that good and don't like us very much. And one of the things that we know and that we can be proud of and that we celebrate is that we don't give up. We know we will always stand up for what we know is right. And we are thankful even for the Mohamos that we have the strength to keep on fighting for what we know is true. Happy Hanukkah! Hanukkah Sameach! Hey! <laughs>